My name is David, this is Kira, and welcome to Seltzer Nation, and today we are reviewing High Noon Tequila Seltzers. Just in time for Cinco de Mayo! It's like St. Patrick's Day, but more cool, because it's tequila. We're gonna start with High Noon Tequila Seltzer Lime. Oh, I can smell the tequila on here. You know what this reminds me of off the nose? The Tequila Cave Epcot Disney World. You get those mixed drinks, and then you try to drink your way around the world, and you end up with pictures on your phone the next day. You and I together, uh -huh. no idea who took them, who but they them? are on your phone. Mm -hmm. It starts with this, this nose. That is delicious. It's very good. Wow. The tequila is not straight up in your face. It's a little hidden by the lime. So if you yourself are not a tequila lover, this lime is, it's covering it and it gives you such a nice refreshing feel to what you're drinking. Moving on to cup number two. High noon tequila seltzer, strawberry. Did you know um, strawberries are not berries? That's weird because they have berry in the I name. I know. But you know what? Barry Bonds, Barry in the name, also not a not a fruit. Neither is Barry Sanders. So I think we've just proven your point that just because something has it in its name, it's not a berry. Doesn't mean that you're a fruit. No, it's still a fruit. Is that offensive? <laughs> oh, that's strawberry. Oh, that's very strawberry. That's like strawberry shortcake. It smells like a strong strawberry gum. Hey, salud. Okay. That's delicious. I like that a lot. Holy moly. Holy moly is right. Strawberry gets tame on the palate. Twinge of tequila, but less tequila than the lime had. That's delicious. So less tequila. So less tequila. This is a strawberry daiquiri, but a virgin. It's not a strawberry margarita either. Like Mary, or like you hope your daughter is. <laughs> Moving on <laughs> to grapefruit. Not even bringing it to the nose. As soon as I crack the no, can, yeah, you can smell. grapefruit galore. So, so good. So I love good. Grapefruit, though. This nose is absolutely phenomenal. That is so good. I think if you like a grapefruit or want something that is not as sweet as a strawberry, the grapefruit is going to do it for you. It's main character vibes, I think. What do you mean by main character vibes? I don't know. It's something that the kids say. You backed like, yourself into the corner like, with that uh, comment. You, you got main character vibes. It's like, you know what's going on. You're just like, oh, The kids say that? Oh my gosh, yeah. <sighs> kids always. Kids are stupid. Kids say the, we the darndest things. Going in deep with the passion fruit. And a little bit of a long pour for me. All right, let's find out more about passion fruit. Yes. I think it spells rindy, like semi-sweet, also known as semi-sweet for those of you from the Midwest. I'm getting a lot of white grape. Oh, the white grape notes coming through in a big way. Right? Oh yeah. You are main charactering this one in a big way. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. I would say out of the pack, this is my least favorite, but it's not horrible. If I were to have it and drink it, on its own, not compared to the other three, I think it's really solid. I do. All right, so Kira, we need to decide what is our favorite. We need to rank these mm -hmm. so that people know when they get the four pack, which ones that they want to drink, which ones that they want to hand to their friends. Are you okay. ready? Okay, sure. All right, Kira, so, what is your number four? My number four is passion fruit. My number four is passion fruit as well. Kira, your number three. Strawberry. I'm gonna go with strawberry as well because it is so strawberry. Kira, what's your number two? I like grapefruit because I love grapefruit. I am gonna take the lime as my number two. I love it, but it is the most tequila forward. I'm gonna want something a little bit more balanced for my number one. In my number one, I do want more tequila. If I'm grabbing a tequila seltzer, I want that tequila taste. So I'm gonna do tequila and lime. My number one is the grapefruit. I think it's a really interesting taste and I could literally pound those all day. In time for Cinco de Mayo, please pick up some high noon tequila seltzer. You will not regret it. And if your rank matches with me, please leave a comment. If your rank matches with David, don't leave a comment. <laughs> leave two comments. Leave two comments. <laughs>